documenting how many cops are on site. All right. So, yeah, yeah we're making the rounds. Okay. So what are we seeing so far? Uh, nothing yet compared to some of the other corners. And now we're down at the corner of 3rd and Washington. A couple guys taking video of the situation. Say they're from the Argonaut. Yep. And we got flashing lights going on. So we're going to use crosswalk. Um, yeah, I suppose. And on the opposite side here, we have two officers, or is it three? Two, two. Moscow City Police officers. Correct. Flagger across the street. And now we're heading down Washington Street on the west side of the street. Nobody hanging out here in front of the hookah shop. But we have... Seems like we have a number of people who are just here to kind of watch. Yeah, plenty of walkers. Hi. Plenty of observers, about a dozen folks hanging out. Exxon reduces Moscow, is that Well, you know how they split them in half, height-wise? They reduced the loads, now they reduce Moscow, too. And on the corner, that's three more officers. Another half dozen observers. And now we're crossing the corner of 2nd and Washington Street, where across the street there's about, oh, what, maybe a dozen observers, something like that. The two police officers on this corner. And we're heading down the street now, down Washington Street, heading north. Still plenty of traffic. For some oddball reason, they changed the lights on flashing at about 10 o'clock. They said the loads would be through about 10.10. Uh, normally, the lights here in Moscow change to flashing at 11. So we're wondering what's going to, you know, are they going to go back to regular or what's going on with the lights? So now we're approaching the corner of First and Washington Street. Three police officers here. Lots of twist ties at the handy. Flagger, another police officer. And over on that corner, there would appear to be, oh, half dozen observers, maybe another couple officers. <coughs> Down this corner, two police officers on bikes, three. Two standing officers. And somebody with a camera up here on um, sort of where the highway starts to curve. Another half dozen observers. Just for clarification, that would be Cass Davis. Oh, so it is. And apparently no law enforcement whatsoever down on the curb. Sort of makes you wonder. And none of us none, none of them are following us either. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting.